And now to Zamfara State, where the governor, Beldo Matawali, says over 10,000 women and youth from across the state are currently benefiting from a monthly stipend of 10 and 20,000 naira under the state social intervention program aimed at reducing poverty. The governor says his administration recognizes the critical importance of creating job opportunities and fighting poverty to ensure peace and stability in all parts of the state. He stated this during the official launch of the Nigeria Poverty Alleviation Stipend Empowerment Program, meant to empower 36 million households across the country. The Oflo Starofoy reports. Zamfara State Social Intervention Program was launched in the year 2019. Authorities in the state says the program has helped in addressing unemployment and youth restiveness. Here comes another social welfare intervention introduced by the United Nations in collaboration with the federal government. The program, according to the National Coordinator, is a strategy to lift 36 million households across the country out of poverty. Governor Bello Matawali at the official launch of the program says over 1 million households in the state will benefit from the program. The Nigeria Poverty Alleviation Stipend Empowerment Program is aimed at assisting the poor and vulnerable in the society. It's a program designed by United Nations to look into the poverty problem in Nigeria because people in Nigeria are living below one level. It is aimed at drastically reducing poverty by empowering 36 million households across the country. In Zampara State, 1 million households will be benefited from this carefully designed and well-articulated program. Governor Bello Matawali noted that his administration is committed to empowering youth, women, and the less privileged. He says over 10,000 women and youth are benefiting from the monthly stipends under the state social intervention program. 8,692 persons drawn from across the 40 local government council are paid 10,000 naira per month we also introduced a special women empowerment program run under the office of the first lady, through which 1,800 women are drawn from across the Porto local government areas and issue a grant of 20,000 each monthly. He commends the federal government for initiating the program, which will go a long way in boosting small and medium scale businesses. So, for the state government says, First batch of beneficiaries were selected from victims of armed banditry and other crisis affected communities, while subsequent selection will focus on 2,000 households in each of the 14 local government areas of the state on an incremental basis until the target of 1 million households is achieved. The governor insists that selection of beneficiaries will be done without any political prejudice. Reaching out to 